Hello, my name is Johnny and this is Sylvie. This is Sylvie and this is here is okay. Puppy. And we are going to tell you about my new instrument, which is called a basuki. This is my basuki. Uh, as you can see, it looks like a normal Irish bazooki, except for one or two crucial differences. Now, the reason why I've made my basuki is because I want to play in a band where we've got no bass player. So I basically made an instrument which is both a bass guitar and a uh, bassoon in one. And the way that we've done it is I went and bought a string of uh, juststrings.com. And would you show them what string it is? So just turn it around so they can see. So, yes, so you can see this is a Didario loop end string. LE078PB. I had absolutely no idea what I was doing. I just bought what looked like the thickest string I could uh, that wasn't the thickest string because I was a bit worried it'd be too big for the bazooki. And I fitted it to this bazooki. And you can put that one down now if you like. And uh, originally I had a little bit of tin foil up here. Because as you can see, it's got a zero fret. So I had a little bit of tin foil on the zero fret. And also, I had a ton of tin foil on the bridge down here to try and stop the string from buzzing and making silly noises. Uh, it doesn't buzz now. And the reason why it doesn't buzz is because our friend Chris has gone and put a nice big nut chunk on here. And he's also redone the bridge. So it makes a lovely sound now like this. Very nice bass on it, and also I've got all the top notes really nice. Okay, so is Poppy going to appear at some point? No? Mm -hmm. Yes? Oh well. Okay, I'm going to tell you a bit about uh, this string here. Uh, and you'll see that I put my cap on. Hello, puppy. Uh, the reason why I have put my cap on is to demonstrate that uh, normally a bazooki is tuned. So these two strings are in octaves, and this one would be an octave higher. The big problem with that was that when I put the capo on, and you see, this string's really thick, and this string was quite thick. The string in the middle was too thin. What happened was it buzzed every time I put the cap on. So what I've done, what I've done is I've replaced, I've replaced this string here with one that's the same pitch, uh, which has the added benefit of meaning that it's a lovely, nice sound, uh, even at the pitch uh, that it is, because it's a, oh, I was missing a bit of middle. And you can hear I've got a very nice middle now. So very nice middle sound, and it just sounds good any place that I play it. So everything works out really nice. Oh, I should say that the uh, string that I replaced it with, Sylvie, can you show them the string that I replaced it with? Thank you. So I've replaced that string with a, 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 a 22 thickness uh, string from Eagle Music. I've got about a million strings that I've bought for various instruments, and I have no idea what instrument they are. So I just pick whatever is useful. Anyway. I think that's it. Can we okay, watch? are you ready to do Drunken Sailor? Are you ready, puppy? Gosh. Good, that's what I like to hear. Here we go. Ready? One, two, three, four. What shall we do with a Drunken Sailor? What shall we do with a Drunken Sailor? What shall we do with a Drunken Sailor? Hello, 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 she rises, 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 <laughs> oh, puppy. 
Okay, thank you very much for watching our video about the Beisuki. Uh, we've had a great deal of fun making it, haven't we, Sylvie? Mm -hmm. Yeah, are we ready to say goodbye? Goodbye. Bye. 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 Goodbye. Okay. Can we watch it? Yeah.